In this video, we're going to talk about the dip switch configuration of the SG TL70 ALM audible loud multi-tone audible segment for the Banner TL70 family. So our loud multi-tone audible alarm segment has two banks of dip switches. The upper white bank of dip switches, we're going to control our inputs and our intensity. In our case, we'll attach to indicator segment already configured as input one. And so to have three tones available, we're going to turn on switches two and three and four. Switches seven and eight are available to control audible intensity. For the purpose of our video, we'll leave them both off for the lowest intensity level. We have the option to go to medium, medium high, or high intensity by changing the positions of seven and eight. Choosing between the four tone options available, we'll do through the black bank of dip switches. Each two switches on the black bank correspond to inputs one through six on the white bank. So because we are using inputs two, three, and four, we'll use switches three and four for number two, five and six for number three, and seven and eight for number four. For input number two, we can choose a chirp alarm. In that case, we will turn switches three and four both on. Switches five and six for input three, we can turn to a siren. This corresponds to five off and six on. And for our fourth input, we will stay with the default continuous alarm setting, meaning we leave switches seven and eight in the off position. So with our switches configured and our audible module attached to the indicator and base, I now have input one tied to my indicator. Input two will be my chirp, input three, my siren, and input four, my continuous. There's my chirp, there's my siren, and there's my continuous alarm. Very easy dip switch configuration for the loud multi-tone audible alarm segment on Banner's TL70.